Hi guys, I just want to make a quick video because I am just fed up of the constant crap I've had to deal with. Um, does this even go down or not? Regarding my new video, I am just so... Oh, here we go again because I don't look right. I just want to clear some things up. The fact that people have been saying, not the majority of people, but... The fact that I'm even having to make this video is just ludicrous to me. I don't like how this is. Sorry, guys. I'm doing it again, but I have to have the right angle. So, guys, I might just... Oh, one second. I know, I know you're all going to have a go. I know this. With this treatment, I just need to address some things. So I want to address something that everyone is, not everyone, that, you know, this new video of mine that has triggered in people's lives. I'm, I can't even, I'm even having to make this video. I want to address the hate that I've had on my new video. It's actually really upsetting to even see because I've had so much, um, Abuse thrown at me, guys, on this new video. Basically, I am, what's the word, conceited. My page is, the people have said my page is a pro-Anna site. I'm not the same person as I was. All, so much shit. All because I'm looking in a viewfinder, I'm checking myself, and I am showing my body in revealing clothes because, number one, guys, I'm going to tell you the two factors as to why I do this. Number one, I've always been vain from the day I was born. I should have been born with a mirror in my hand. I've always been vain from the day one. Ask my mum, ask anyone. I've always been vain. Even in the beginning of my videos, I remember getting some shit because I was looking in the mirror. I remember from the beginning, I've always been vain. Sorry, guys. Do I need to... Can you even... Is that better? Yeah, so I've always... No, I don't, I don't like it. See, this is what I mean. It has to be right. I've always been vain. Always. So, and number two, the two, the one... I'm so angry about this. I can't even begin to speak. So, number one, I've been vain. The, the two reasons why I check myself and do all this crap that you all hate and clearly is perceiving myself, is portraying myself to be a person which I'm not. I look in the mirror... I'm, con you know, that's who I am. I look in the mirror, I'm vain. Number two, when I video, I have a voice in my head right now, like I have it right now. It's saying, as stupid as this sounds, because of my eating disorder, it says to me, the voice in my head, well, not an actual voice, but the voice in my head says to me, people are going to think that you have gained weight since your last video. That to me, as stupid as it sounds, is so damaging to me because of my eating disorder. And eating disorders are the most... They are the most vainest, the most, they're the most, you know, self-absorbed disorders that, that there ever will be, I think. I really do, because everything's about image. It's all about the way you look. And, but I know, but deeper down, deeper, deeper down, it's not about that. It's, a, you know, mentally, it's about how you look. It's the control is the biggest thing why I do this. You know, I've had such a shit fucking year. I've lost my best friend. I have lost so much in my life, different things that I can't talk about. So stressful that you won't even understand. We're talking about, you know, stuff within myself as a person, which I can't talk about, that I'm going through emotionally. There's so much that's happened to me in my life, guys. And it's all taken a toll. And my best friend passing away, it just blew me completely 
into pieces. It just shattered me, guys. It shattered me. It was the last, it was the last thing that I could take. And people deal with trauma by stress. Stress, no, they don't deal with stress. Stress, you know. Sorry, guys, it's not recording. So basically, people deal with eating just with, with trauma different ways. For me, I lost loads of weight through stress. My eating disorder kicked up kicked kicked back kicked back off again and you know why should i have to subject myself to the hate that i get online it, it stopped recording i just i just want to you know i want you to understand the, the shit that i've gone through i mean the comments that i've i've had saying that i'm promoting this i'm promoting that i don't want to promote any eating disorder whatsoever I want people to be healthy, happy, whatever weight you are at. I am not about that life. I want to, all I want to do is spread positivity on my channel. But I didn't realise that checking myself and being vain is supporting an eating disorder. That's absolutely bullshit. And I don't agree with it, guys. I just want you to understand, I've had a lot happen in my life. And, you know, the fact that I look at myself in the mirror, I'm checking myself. You need to understand why. You know, I'm trying to stop the voice in my head that say, you're this, you're that, you're useless, you're worthless. So the more I look in the mirror, the more, you know, if I think I look better, I can relax because that's how bad it is. And people think, you know, that sounds so shallow and self-centered. Oh my God, you're looking in the mirror because you want to look, you know, thinner than you did in your last video. Yes, my eating disorder is sadistic. It is, it is, it's not... A normal thing to think and I know that but I can't help these thoughts it's not life isn't about body image it's not about looking thin it's not about that guys but in my brain the control over me says you have to be these things imagine if your brain says you have to like the color white you have to that's how it is to me but the subject is always weight I don't want to be like this I want to be able to enjoy food I want to be able to be like a normal normal person what is normal you know I don't want to feel like this so I have to sit down and I have to address this. If you don't want to watch me, don't watch me. I'm not promoting anything. I love every single one of you, my supporters, the people that understand and that, and that have been there for me and that understand this. Thank you so much for your love and support. It's meant the absolute world. If you don't want to watch my videos, you know, you should, you know, I'm actually doing content that I'm proud of, you know, and happy with. And I'm, I'm letting you into my life and I get this. So I might as well just carry on doing the mukbangs. Not, don't speak, don't have a personality, chop some onions and then everyone's going to love me. No, because making mukbangs for a long time made me feel depressed. You know, I enjoyed making them for you guys because you, you know, I enjoyed the, the final result. But the process of eating something when you're battling something in your head, do you know how hard that is? You know, I am still going to make occasional mukbangs for you guys because i know some of you really miss them but they're not going to be like the world where i do one every week every single month and every single minute of the day no and i thank you the guys the people that love me that understand that 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 have supported that and that you know are still sticking by me you know i'm actually going to do a mukbang next week this week and it's going to come out next week i think because i know that you guys are, are missing it i'm still got catering i'm still pushing myself for you guys because I know people enjoy mukbangs but I will be predominantly doing vlogs because that's what I enjoy and love you know but I, these comments have to stop these horrible triggering comments you think I'm triggering what you're doing is you're triggering someone who's clearly got struggles if you don't like my channel if you don't like the way I pout the way I, I look the way I do things like I'm doing it again now oh my god help you know if you don't like it then don't simply watch guys I'm not, oh, that looks so ugly. See, this is me. This isn't even in my mind. I'm just like this. This is me. If you don't like it, use something else as your, as your reason as to why you don't like me. Don't go so low that you have to mention an eating disorder. The fact that I'm even being so honest, honest, and I'm telling you this, and I'm, you know, maybe I shouldn't be so honest about my eating disorder. Maybe it's so alien to people. The fact I'm even letting into my life about such a sensitive subject you know, give me some fucking credit for that. Don't tear me down and throw pro Anna names at me and stuff like this, which is stuff that's absolutely disgusting and I do not agree with whatsoever. You know, don't mistake me being vain and looking in the mirror, checking myself for me promoting anything because the only thing I want to fucking promote is love and body positivity. I don't want anyone to go through what I'm going through right now. 
But do you know how much it hurts to hear stuff like that from people, even subscribers that I thought were actually there for me? What do I get? Not, you know, I get a barrel of abuse. I'm just sick of it and it's upsetting. And the fact I'm making this video is just ridiculous in itself. But for the people that love me and support me, thank you so much. Just know two things. I look in the viewfinder. This is what I mean. I'm having to justify why I look in the viewfinder. I look in the viewfinder because, number one, sometimes, yeah, I look, I look, I look good. I feel good. Well, I, look, I feel good most of the time. Number two, my voice is in my head saying to me, you look like this, you look like that. Yes, it sounds stereotypical. Yes, it sounds shallow. I know that. Do you not think I know that? I know right from wrong. I'm not stupid. And number three... I don't know. Yeah, number number one is because of, you know, how my eating disorder is portraying in, in my head. No, no, number one, because of, my, because of what's going on in my mind. Number two, because genuinely I think I look ugly. And number three, because, yeah, sometimes I look good and I think, oh my God, that's really cool. Haven't we all thought that and felt like that? But no, I do it. But because I've lost weight, I'm categorised in this fucking pattern, in this, in this, um, box that I'm this and that I'm not the same person do you know how hurtful it is to hear that from some from anyone it's hurtful but why is this ear sticking out this is what I mean so yeah guys I don't even know what to say anymore I think I've gone on way too much but if you enjoyed my videos thank you for watching see I'm doing it again I do it all the time you should, you should hear like people in my life they're like oh my god you're going on again like this is what I'm like if you don't like it don't watch you know it's hard what I'm going through, but I'm not the only person and I'm not claiming to be the only person. That's another thing I wanted to address. I am me. I'm going through a struggle. I'm letting you into my life. If you don't like it, don't watch. Honestly, I don't care. That's a lie. I do care because I'm making this video. I, the only thing I care about why I'm making this video is, is because I don't want to give the wrong message to people. To people that watch me, to young people, I don't want to give that message. I want people to understand what I'm going through. Have some empathy. If you don't, don't fucking watch. And that is it. And I want to I want to be there for people. I want you to have fun with me. I want to have fun doing these vlogs. I want to have fun doing these mukbangs, you know. I don't want this. It's scary to me now reading comments. I'm thinking, oh my God, it's really affecting me, guys. The shit that I've read today. And I know it comes with part of the territory of YouTube. Is you know, it comes, it come, you know, hate comes as part of the territory. But when we're crossing boundaries and saying I'm triggering people and blah 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 i'm not having that and i've got to put a stop to it do you know what i mean like seriously the only person you're triggering is myself because you're making me go deeper and deeper into this fucking headspace guys whoever it is not you guys but the person that's been nasty to me so anyway i've rambled long enough i love you all so much thank you for watching why is my hair so flat and there'll be a new uh, vlog soon see i'm doing it again and i don't give a shit and yeah a new mukbang as well next week love you bye